Been working on a story about hit and runs in Oklahoma City. Uh, Oklahoma City police have reported more than 400 hit and runs a month for the past year. It's kind of a rising figure. So I was driving south on Penn and I had just passed 122nd and I was stopped waiting to turn into the McDonald's parking lot when all of a sudden someone rear-ended me going approximately 65 miles per hour. Remind you, I was stopped and they hit me so hard, rear-ended me kind of at an angle that it spun my car sideways. As I was sideways in the middle of pin, they T-boned me before they went up over the curb. I thought they were just pulling off the side of the road since I was blocking most of it. And uh, they went up over the curb and just fled. <laughs> and I was so surprised that, you know, this wasn't any fender bender. They hit me really hard. I was taken by ambulance on a stretcher. My car was totaled to pieces and their whole front bumper and grill was attached to my car. I just couldn't believe that someone just up and left after something like that. I have six bulging discs. At 24 I have arthritis all down my spine and um, I'm going to physical therapy. I'm getting epidural injections into my spine. Um, I had sprained my hips and my neck and I'm still wearing a brace to this day. The doctor said that there's not much more they can do for me. They can only do a certain amount of epidural injections a year and pretty much that I'm gonna have to deal with it the rest of my life or until I decide to get surgery.